Hello friends, James Corbett here, CorbettReport.com. You'll recall that a week or two ago I did a short little video on shut up burglary theorist where I talked about the fun little thought experiment. Wouldn't it be interesting if we lived in a world where burglary theorism was der dis derided in the same way that conspiracy theorism is derided in ours? But I was bemused to note that the majority of the feedback on that video had nothing to do with the video itself, but about the background of the video. James, there's no trees, there's no greenery, there's no wildlife, you can't hear any birds in the background. Is that what Japan is like? I mean, we can't see, we can't see any trees in the frame of the video. <laughs> yeah, well, it does raise an interesting point. For those of you who have never been to Japan, is this Japan? Or is this Japan? Or is this Japan? Or is this Japan? No, 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 no. This is Japan. Hmm, words to live by scrawled on the side of a building instead of graffiti. Yeah, that seems pretty Japanese. Corn soup from a vending machine? Now that's Japan. Is this Japan? Because if it is, I feel a regime change operation coming. Or maybe this is Japan? Okay, okay, you get my point. I mean, you do get the point, right? This isn't about what Japan does or does not look like. This is a more important point, a vastly more important point, about the way media can literally frame your perception or your understanding of the world. Because if you think that what is being shown to you in a specific frame is that thing, then you're not thinking about what they are not showing you. What if I pointed the camera this way? What if I pointed the camera this way? What if I pointed the camera this way? Or what if I pointed the camera this way. So whether it's being done uh, deliberately and with forethought, or whether it's just happening by happenstance, the point is the media can literally frame your understanding of a, a, way, uh, a place in a way that you don't even consciously think about. You see a three minute video of someone walking through some new residential area in some part of Japan and you ask, is that Japan? Media Literacy 101 friends, if that can happen to you with a video like this, then think about the ways your understanding of what's happening in Syria or Ukraine or anywhere else is shaped by what they show you and what they do not show you in any given frame. It's literally framing your perception of the world. Again, a vastly important point. I really hope it's not lost on the audience out there. But if you are interested in what does Japan look like, I did put a, together a video called uh, uh, the Sunny Climbs of Western Japan for my 2009 video archive DVD available for purchase from CorbettReport.com slash DVD uh, CorbettReport.com slash shop one or the other uh, and I'll just tack it on to the end here anyway, James Corbett, CorbettReport.com
ladies and gentlemen, I present Japan. No, wait, that'll get me flagged for sure.